Okay, so we're here at the container on Belmont Road. I'm Jill from Rattle Litter Pickers. This Hi, is... I'm Fiona from Incredible Edible. And this is Andrea and Andrea. So the fire was on Friday afternoon about half past five. And as you can see, there's quite extensive damage. We were really disappointed because we're all volunteers. Most of this has been donated to us over four years. And at the moment, most of it's well, it's unsalvageable. You could call this a bit of a modern art, a bit of a sculpture. They're either welded together or melted together. We're really, really disappointed, but we'll start again. We'll know we can build it up again. Um, and as you can see here today, we are two, at least two teams joined together to come and salvage what we can. And that's what we've been really pleased to see is the response from the local community, from people who have seen the response from the local community, people who have seen and heard about what's happened and we have had many offers of help and donations for in the future for when we're ready to get back up and going again. So that has been really heartwarming actually. Yeah, it's been great. Um, we're all part of a group called Growing Together. Look it up on Facebook and you can see what all these groups do in the community. Um, we do a lot of good work. So, you know, we won't be defeated. You have destroyed a lot of, well, four and a half years of work we had just recently racked it all out. It was really neat and tidy and it was gone in like 15 minutes. Anyway, for a little bit of humour, we need four candles. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to laugh or you're crying. I was crying this morning. <laughs> uh, and just to add on to it, following on from four candles, we can definitely vouch for the durability of an Asda bag. Definitely a bag for life. Thank you.